Hey, Barbie. Can I come to your house tonight? Sure. I don't have anything big planned, just a giant blowout party with all the Barbies and plant choreography and a bespoke song. You should stop by. So cool. Here we go, Barbie day one. When we were doing rehearsals, um, we were talking about this, you know, big scene and this thing that America has this amazing uh, monologue in the film. Mm. And she, I was like, I just, you know, Barbie's meant to change after she hears this. And like, what is it that I'm hearing that makes her change? And she said, and I don't know why it really hit me, but it did. She was like, I release you from your assignment. And I was like, I, Margot needed to hear that so badly. I can't tell you how much a weight lifted off my shoulders weirdly when she said that. So I was like, we've got to make this movie and it's the biggest movie I've ever produced. And I've got, you know, got to answer to two humongous corporations and a director I really respect and actors and blah, 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 blah. And also at the same time, when's the last time I talked to my mom and did I send my friend a birthday present and blah, 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 blah. And then she was just like, I release you from your assignment. And I was like, thank you. <laughs> we're putting a lot of expectations on ourselves to be everything and do everything and be perfect like this pursuit of perfection which is impossible anyway but to also I don't know maybe it's because it's like the generation of multi hyphen it's this idea that you have to be this and this and this and good at that and be a good friend and be a good spouse and be you know like it's just a lot and honestly if I can give one gift to anyone it's like you can go to this movie and just like let go of all of that like you are doing great your to-do list you have today, it's gone. If I can do that for you, it's gone. You don't have a to-do list anymore. You can just enjoy. What do I have to do? You have to go to the real world. You can go back to your regular life or you can know the truth about the universe. It's a spicy margarita. <laughs> it's definitely, there's like a lot packed into it. And um, I'm so glad that you woke up thinking, thinking thoughts you didn't know you'd have. I always wanted it to surprise people. I wanted it to make people laugh, but then I also wanted it to kind of almost in that unexpectedly make people think and cry. <laughs> Hi, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Uh, Hi, Ken. Hi, Ken. I mean, I've never worked on anything like it, it. You know, Greta's brilliant, as you know, but she's also just, and, and Margot as well, like the way that they curated this experience for all of us, even like right now what we're having, but it also was the same on set. Just the most talented people, everyone was so wonderful. Everybody was just like the best at what they, at they did, what they did. And, you know, just created this environment for everyone to sort of thrive, you know? It just was, it's, it's an explosion of art. It's like, it's like a sculpture garden. It's like a museum. It's like there's just the props and people's makeup and their wig and their costume and the thing and the thing. It was like the work of so many incredible sculptors and artisans was like mm. given voice and given space. And uh, it was like, mm -hmm. This is so amazing. And then hold. Like after you say it, go. That comes through is that like you love her. Right. You know, you do. You love her. I think well, I, I think there is a, a dimension of that which is true, which is this the kind of pink. There was a kind of pink that we did completely use all of it that existed it, there was no more of it and I think also conversely we used up all of the um, the gray felt in London because the problem with having an entirely pink set is it's a pink bounce onto everybody's face so even here you can see there's a white bounce Rodrigo every single thing that's not on the camera is covered in gray so that it didn't create a pink bounce onto people's face so we simultaneously created a shortage of pink and gray no one rests until this doll is back in a box. Even if 